All right, what's going on, y'all? Um, we're gonna make this short because we're running late. Uh, fishing Tuesday nighter again, not with Braden. Braden's down in Texas, so we're fishing it solo. Um, no front graphs, we bust them off uh, at Claire, the front shroud, and we're waiting on that part to come in. So we're pretty much just gonna be junk fishing shallow all night, but gotta get the boat in the water, so I'll see you guys out there. I got a four letter word, but I don't care. A whole lot of drive to get me there. I've seen a whole lot of wrong, to say the least. Spent a whole lot of time staring down the beach. Well, we got a late start, so we're just gonna start right on these docks next to the ramp and see what happens. Gotta be 14. <sighs> All right, number one, three minutes in. <laughs> Well, we got about one, two, three, four, four docks in next to the ramp. Caught number one there, so keep doing this. Maybe we won't even start the big motor tonight. He ain't gonna make the cut. Well, we're about 10 docks in. We've caught three fish already, two shorts, one keeper, so gonna keep running them. Oh, just lost both my pinchers. broke off on one. Probably my fault because I haven't been checking my line. It sucks. We're gonna change rods. Feeling that line is just pretty frayed. It's been on there for a couple weeks and I've been fishing docks pretty hard so do a different rod real quick. Another short. Check him real quick, but I think he's gonna be short. Gosh dang. I have the gun. Yep, short. <laughs> there we go. That's what we're after right there. Gosh dang, look at that. Oh man, can't even get a handle on. There we go. Good one, look at that. Jewel jig right down the throat there. Use another one of those for sure.
knocked off another one there. That was a big one. I seen him. It was only like two and a half, three. Ah, that blows. Maybe close, maybe close. Thirteen. Well guys, quick little update. We're about an hour in now. We got three fish, got one good one. Uh, broke off one good one. Um, then we got two other uh, small ones. And as you guys can tell, we've been uh, catching a decent amount of shorts. So I think we're gonna stick to docks the rest of the night. And hopefully we can get one or two more good bites and uh, fill out our limits. So. Good one. Oh, another good one right there. Nice. Look at that one. Two pounder, two and a quarter probably. All right, guys, you guys probably can't see me too well because the sun's behind me, but camera died. We got number five. It's like a two and a quarter. We got two 14 inches in there that we really need to get rid of. We got about an hour and a half left, so I'm going to keep fishing. All right, y'all, so just ended. Um, ended up calling again one more time off camera. Uh, sec that was the second time my camera died and I didn't switch batteries and then um, called up, I don't know, maybe a quarter of a pound, if that. I think we got somewhere floating around 10 pounds. Sounds like pretty much all the boys caught them tonight. So I don't really think we're gonna cash a check, but we will see. Um, so yeah. That's what we got right there. I'm gonna go wham in. Four and five. All right, guys, I'm just put the boat back in the barn. Um, obviously, weighing's over and everything. Uh, solo mission tonight ended up uh, being pretty good. Had more than I thought that I had. Ended up weighing 1234, uh, which was good enough for the win tonight. Uh, I think there was 12 or 13 boats maybe. Um, so pretty happy with it. Uh, as you guys saw, I caught a decent number of fish. Nothing crazy. Uh, but I got uh, three good ones. My big one was uh, 359. I had another one that was like a probably close to three and a half and then one that was like two and three quarter two and a half and then two small ones um, as you guys saw I lost two that probably would have helped my bag but good thing that they didn't uh, come back to bite me I broke off those two and then lost one on a frog all the fish I caught tonight was on this jewel bait finesse jig in the special ops series that special ops series just has that little bit of a beefier hook on it right there so it's um, good for when you're throwing heavier line and stuff like that um yeah and then the rod that i ended up using you guys saw me switch rods right there in the middle of the day this is just uh, dobbins champion 703 uh this is actually not my preferred dock rod uh but like i said the line that i had on my dock rod which is the dobbins uh 6104 uh champion uh was bad because i probably haven't changed it in a month or so and fish docks a lot so this ended up being the tool that I needed for tonight and then this is what I landed all my fish on you guys saw me lose at least one on a frog I don't know if I got the other two blow ups on camera um, but yeah